Hello, Stetson Stallions. It's your art teacher, Miss Clark. This week, we're going to be learning about a British sculptor, photographer, and environmentalist named Andy Goldsworthy. When we're done, I'm going to show you guys how to create your work of art for this week, and finally, how to submit it using what is called an artist statement. This will be the first week that we are not taking a picture of our artwork, and that's okay. All right, guys, so I hope you enjoy learning more about the artist, Andy Goldsworthy, and I look forward to seeing what you guys create. Andy Goldsworthy is a British sculptor, photographer, and environmentalist. He's known for creating art outside using found objects from nature. He uses stuff such as stone, wood, leaves, and ice. His goal is to understand the materials. When he creates art, he wants it to be a collaboration between himself and nature. This week, you will be designing your own creation outside, just like the artist Andy Goldsworthy. The first thing you'll need to do is go on a scavenger hunt outside. You're going to be looking for leaves, flowers, rocks, grass, anything you guys can use. But always make sure that you check with a parent or guardian before collecting materials. Once you have a collection, what you're going to do is find a space outside to create. Go ahead and think about what you want your work of art to be. Maybe you want to focus on using the element of line or shapes or using patterns or maybe you want to think back to when we talked about balance and create a mandala just like we did with our last activity. Again, it's up to you. But go ahead, take some time, find some materials, and get started creating outside. Once you guys are done, you're welcome to take a photo just like the artist Andy Goldsworthy to keep it for your own record or to upload it onto Artsania, but you are not required to submit a photograph for this project. So I'm going to show you guys how you're going to submit your assignment. Remember, this time when you guys are done creating, you do not need to take a picture, so no picture. What you're going to do is go back to the assignment when you're done. You're going to go ahead, check the steps. You already watched the video because you're watching it right now. Two, you're going to create your designs. So you're going to go outside or use objects in your house to create your design. And three, you're going to go ahead and open the Google form below. The Google form is going to be creating an artist statement. An artist statement is like a paragraph that describes a work of art that's written by an artist so they can help share with other people to understand the process and what they created. Now, I'm not going to have you guys write a paragraph today, but you are going to be answering some of the questions that are used within an artist statement. First question is gonna say, who was the artist? This is gonna be your first and last name because you're the one creating the work of art. Two, you're gonna describe your artwork. So, since I can't see your design, I want you to tell me what it looks like using a lot of details. Think about the colors, the shapes, what does it look like, what does it feel like? All that fun stuff. The next question is gonna be, how did you create your art? So what materials did you use? Did you use rocks, leaves, flowers? Do you know what types? Think about your artwork. Look at it. What did you use to make it? Then tell me. The next question is going to be, who or what inspired your design? So I want you to think about who the artist was. Who was that person we were learning and talking about earlier in this video? Was it Baby Yoda? I don't think so. Then go ahead, select your choice, and move on to the next question. The next question, or final question, is going to say, what are your overall thoughts about your arc? What do you think? If you were to redo it, what would you change? What would you keep? It's up to you. Once you're done with all the questions, go ahead, press submit. And you're all done. This is all I need this week. Just watch the video, create design, don't need a photo, then answer the Google form. Have a great day, artist.